Hello everyone, <clears throat> and welcome back to another episode of our <laughs> complicated Phoenix Point campaign. So, last thing we attempted was to visit this Pandora node uh, at the ha Haven or Shaw. Wait, was it the last thing we did? But in any case, yeah, I, th I think... Wow, now I'm very confused. It doesn't matter. Uh, I remember that we had a very rough mission where a lot of people got very low, but we managed to escape with everyone alive, which is uh, actually quite impressive. Yes, yes, of course, that's that's what missing. Uh, I confused two different missions. Uh, the Bionic Fortress, we would have the opportunity to defeat the Pure if we wanted, but we don't want right now. Our biggest problem right now is that we are severely lacking uh, resources, because we have reached the point where we can start accumulating a lot of uh, interesting powers, uh, like uh, cybernetics and so on, but we really don't have the materials, tech and uh, tech and materials to really get them going. And we still are supposed to engage with these things, uh, but it's complicated. Perfect escape, actually. Very good. Okay, the afterburner got uh, hurt. So you are going to heal and you need to go back to base. Base has suffered serious damage, that's fine. Huh. This is new. It appears that a splinter group of Anu are worshipping a grotesque Pandora mutation. Our spy inform us of gruesome, inhumane rituals. Normally we don't take a stand against the excesses of fringe Anu cults, but in this case an armed response is warranted. The cult's base is located in a remote area. The sooner we get there, the better. Corruption of the mind. This is new. I have never seen this. And it's uh, kind of accessible to us, so we may, we may evaluate of going on a on a mission completing rave. However, for now, we have to continue attacking. Can we even trade with you? No, they want food. <clears throat> so, intercept. Engage. We want to take down this if we can. The problem here is that they're gonna be shooting spikes and we'll get hit by all of them. Ow. No, you know what? This is not the ship to have this battle with. I am sorry. Um, this thing attacks at such a long distance that we're gonna get wrecked. Okay. What we can do is go back to base. <laughs> hey, Sulurk. Thank you for showing up. Actually, you know what? It seems like I don't have this thing going on. Um, it is mostly because I had just had a very good lunch and I feel like streaming. So that makes streaming a lot easier. Okay. Uh, the next thing you say, then maybe we'll get some messages out of it. Okay, so we have repaired the afterburner, therefore we can turn around and try again. Okay, now you have to repair. And we will intercept again. <clears throat> okay, so this time we're gonna dodge early so that we can dodge again. Perfect, there we go. Very good. This visual guidance, yes. So we're gonna activate dodge one last time. And then we're gonna focus on the spikes. Very good. And then we're gonna lower the speed a little bit because I want to be able to dodge the next one too. Woo, nice. Okay, and with that, all the weapons of the enemy have been destroyed and we are also out of out of afterburner. So we hope that our 24 missiles are in. And they were. What did we get? 
we got something out of that. Very cool. Um, so Cynedrion, oh my god, this, this was actually great. Cynedrion is really happy that we helped. And also we got 400 materials and some tech. Amazing. Okay, let's fly back. Uh, very good protection of Cynedrion then. And what do we do next? First we check. Can we replace Valentina with Kara? Is Kara even here? Kara is at the gift. So we can trade Kara for Valentina. Absolutely no problem. And the gift has the bike. And the Helios has the car. Okay, so Helios go here. And then gift go here. So this haven is probably gonna get demolished. Um, let's get everyone together first. Oop. Haven was damaged by Behemoth. Okay, very decent. Personnel. Uh, Tiamat. Vantina can no longer tank correctly. Then I'm going to need car 2. And then I'm going to need Kara. Perfect. Uh, in the meantime, car 2 can go back to the Helio. Uh, car 1 can go to Helios and Valentina to here. And then we check. So, uh, for Citizen Eileen, we would love to create. Maybe, you know what? Maybe it's a good idea to start a table. And I think I'm going to do that right now. I hate that we lose focus of the game every time we have to have... Can I try again? Yep, immediate focus loss. Okay, so I'm gonna write it down first, and then later we will take care of it. Okay, so if I go to Citizen Eileen, what are we missing for you, Citizen Eileen? Um, Eileen wants... Uh, shoulder... Rocket, because she can use it and therefore we should totally put it on her. We have to use these points, it makes no sense not to use them, right? So what shall we do? Mm. I feel like we should cross class with either Infiltrator or Priest. But you know what, I would like to know what an Infiltrator can really do. Infiltrator, what do you have? Suppress attack. Attacks from behind gain shock value. Interesting. Holographic decoy, very good. Secondary class. Deploy three spider drones with one. Vanish. Move within five tiles and disappear from view for the next turn or until spotted. Okay. And sneak attack. Damage dealt while not spotted is increased by 50%. Okay. Actually, this is great, right? Because Sniffer class. Uh, <laughs> Sniffer class. Because I think there is a mutation for silent attacks, or is that a head mutation actually? But we got the prospector head, yeah, nice. And then legs, perception, electric kick. No, it's not a leg either. Is it an augmentation? Mind control immunity, neural disruption, it's a head. I mean, it could be fine. I think we should be able to cross class with no problem. Uh, because we really need to increase the damage that Citizen Eileen can perform. And honestly, right now we are having trouble with that. What else could you have if you wanted? Heavy lifter, that's garbage, demolition state. This speed, there is some speed. And stealth plus 20, okay. That's actually very, oh, but less accuracy and no perception bonus. We really need the accuracy. I think cross class makes perfect sense here. And we're gonna do that. Infiltrator training. We are a class creator right now. Good. 
So, surprise attack, gain shock value. Attacks from behind. This is actually very specific. And then damage dealt while not spotted. So we're gonna grab this. Sneak attack. How much do we have? 270? Yeah, we need to start using some of these points. We are at that point in that in the in the game. Additionally, I want to grab this and I want to up my willpower. We got stealth bonus. Uh, that's very good. I feel like I need a little bit here and here. I think Citizen Eileen deserves the spending, but maybe that's too much. And uh, even the strength is a bit too much. Okay, I think that was that was already good enough. So also we want to get the shoulder rocket, uh, and we won't we won't spend points into that until we can get it. And we also want to get um, Synedrion Sniper, Synedrion Sniper gear. Because it also has a currency and Synedrion is OP as we all know. Right, let's confirm. Armor. Is this the Sniper gear? Infiltrator, Assault, Sniper, there. So the helmet, no, but the leg and the body. Speed minus one, we can deal with that. Accuracy plus five, accuracy plus five. And stealth plus ten, this is just so good. And they're kind of cheap, so I think, I think we can afford this. Okay, that would put Citizen Eileen at a prime position. Very good. Now, do we want to move someone else over? Like, uh, okay, we don't have any other person. I think we are missing a priest. I think we are missing like an official, real priest. Speaking of which, you probably should get a new head. So Scream, Frenzy or Radiant Hope. Frenzy is character's increased speed and immune to panic. Uh, but this one will allow me to cast more spells, basically. So... Let's do it. Okay, Kara, you are now very scary, and I think I would prefer... I mean, you're usually inside the car. So I think we're gonna go like this. That makes you look cool. This is a scary priest, priest if I've ever seen one, so... <laughs> Pretty cool. Uh, it may be worth to grab Psychic Ward. Allies within 10 tiles are immune to panic and psychic damage, but we've never seen psychic damage either, so what's the point? And then, do I want to speed? I think I will grab this way later, so not now. Okay, can you carry more things? You can, so how about we get you another medkit? No, I'm not. That's fair. Okay, so, Kara now has everything. Pascal. Pascal, you have everything you want. I think I need... Uh, Pascal needs uh, modular blast protection. That would be the only thing that can really bring us down quickly. Uh, and the question is, do we want to put something heavy on your head? Because right now that's the piece that has the least armor. No, actually that's a lie. The legs are also 20-ish, assault-ish. Okay, but uh, other than that you seem to be going on a good pace. You will eventually become a shotgun slash melee specialist. Uh, is this ready for action? Yes. But I think maybe return fire with a shotgun makes sense. Kinda like it. Let's grab it. So that whenever someone shoots at us from really close, at least we'll be able to answer. Okay. Pistolier, what are you missing? You are missing 
Uh, sniper of Sinedrion. Sniper. The sniper gear. And then what else shall we do with you? We start using neural pistol instead of uh, heavy because whenever we want to deal damage. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, with this, we could probably disable a, a, like a Kiron in one turn if we unload everything on it. Hmm. I'm gonna give it a shot and see how I feel about it during a mission. If it doesn't work out, we will quickly learn. Uh, do you want to carry more things? No. Do you want to Overwatch for less? Hmm. No, not really. And do you want the secondary class? Ooh, that's a good question. I think we should do Infiltrator again, right? Uh, I could also go for Priest Training, but the, no, the head piece has already been occupied, so forget it. Infiltrator Training. Nice. So, let's go for the same thing here. It's gonna cost us some materials, but whatever. That feels pretty good. Okay. So we move on to Ronzo. I think Ronzo would also like the sprinting legs. Um, he's a grenadier. So maybe we need to go with the secondary class of um, of boom blasting. Oh my god! That means I could I could unload my entire inventory of grenades if I use. Oh no, never mind. It still costs one KP. But if I go for heavy training, I could get Boom Blast, and then I could throw grenades at 1 AP. That sounds actually quite interesting. Quite, quite interesting. And considering that I have no special attack thing, I could consider um, a heavy weapon. Very interesting ideas. Bonus healing power. Bonus carry weight, very good. So is this the regeneration? Yes. So what are the headpieces doing again? Immune to mind control, neural disruption, and I wonder what disoriented does. It's not hmm. disoriented is not the same as um Cannot speak anymore. As dazed. There we go. So I don't know what the Saurian does. <sighs> when we look at augmentations, I think the legs just win every time. Plus three speed. The rest just pales in comparison. Okay. So do I want to act on this right now? I mean, it did reach seven. He kind of deserves it. So let's go. Heavy training. We're gonna give you Warcry because Warcry is amazing. And then we're gonna give you this. And you know what? This one is also very cool. That's. We just made a super soldier. Okay. So do we want to give you a minigun? That would be a good question. I guess the answer is not yet. I guess we could also only use this uh, auto cannon. Okay. We want to bash for more. It's just 10 SP. Now we can wait and earn those 10 SP through missions. Okay. Kara, we're already done with you, right? Yeah. So, Kara, Ronzo, Pistolier, Shotgun, and Sixty. Okay. That being said, it would be cool if we started aiming towards having no vehicle. Because 8 turns is a lot more than uh, 1 turn. Uh, 5 turns, sorry. Or 6 turns, to be precise. Uh, which means I want a melee person, Valentina. Oh, I don't know if I want Valentina, actually. Like, two melee people at the same time. We already have a sniper. Uh, sorry, a shotgun. I think the team that could replace a car is... Uh, fully geared Kiwi. Which would be a stealth person. 
because we want Mimic, ah, but we, we could have two Mimics through the Snipers, hmm. Still, I, I think I should consider uh, someone like this, then uh, a real Priest, like a full-on caster that can use Frenzy at the start of the mission, I think that would be very important. Um, and then a Grenadier, the heavy person. Uh, so uh, actually anyone with heavy weapon specialty would work. Do we even have someone with that? Yeah, heavy. Heavy weapon specialty. So we could make you into the Grenadier. But we wanted to make you a minigunner, right? Ah, this is so tricky. Okay, so... And we're not even using this person quite often, so... Okay. One thing at a time. You know what? We're gonna save up some resources and then we're gonna take care of those things. And I think I can still... Even then... What is this? Psychic damage. Locate enemies. Repeller module. I think I want one of these. Yeah, but they... They cost so much tech anyway. Um... This one is important, twice, and I think I want another round of the body armor and helmet. Okay. Wait, no, that's incorrect. And leg. There we go. Body armor leg, body armor leg. Okay, that sounds good. Um... What else do we want? Do we want the priest? Yes, we said this. Who can go and pick up a priest? I think the Helios should do that. And uh, who is going to wait? Well, David the car. He needs repairs. So David the car will wait over there. And we're gonna go pick up a priest. Right there. Helios, go. Then we're gonna go back to the Tiamat, who is now fully geared, fully repaired, fully everything. And I think I'm just gonna go disappear the pure, even though they didn't have a lot of participation. Uh, it's just a good idea to get that red, to get that done. Okay, this changes things. Where is this Hanu Haven? Ah, that seems that seems very far in the distance. I don't think the Tiamat can get there in time. So, if we put everyone together, like both ships together, maybe we can get there in time. Therefore, we grab you, we ask, do we want to take David the car or the bike? I think the bike is actually correct here. So we're gonna send you over here. You click here, recruit salt. Oh my god, why does he cost so much? Come on, he's level 1. Is this for real? Is this gonna be the cost everywhere? 800 food? What were they thinking? Oh, well, just that's the cost now. Can I afford 800 wood food? Yes, I can afford because I could just build another food processor and then we'll just... My god, you're expensive. I hope you come with such perfect thing of boom that you are amazing. And somehow I don't believe that. You come with... I forgot about... Yes, it's still Frenzy. Oh, I got lucky. Oh, that could have been so bad. But it wasn't. Very good. Okay, so let's put this, this. We're gonna craft another one of these. And uh, we should probably order some more. Factory... Oh yeah, we can now make poison grenades. You know what? I'm gonna start making those. As soon as I find them. Oh, that worked out. Chimera grenade. It's uh, 30 blast, 40 poison. 50 blast, 10 shred. Eh. I guess we'll learn. Yeah, let's, let's make 4. That should be... Okay, so now we can all meet here. 
but we're not starting the mission until both ships are together. In the meantime, the Bionic Fortress. Location, transmission, appears to be pure central space. Presence of multiple fully bionic soldiers, subject 24 himself. Should we succeed in killing him, the likelihood the rest of the crew will fall in disarray. Start the mission. I went over these people 20 times, but we can check if one of the armor pieces got done. The answer is no, none of them. I can also check if anyone is by chance having like a paralysis pistol, which is not gonna do anything. Good that I caught on that. Then we're gonna check all grenades. Bring some more. I guess uh, we have the EMP grenade as well. Let's put it here. Just to, to remind ourselves of it. I don't have two grenades to carry, so I think I'm gonna go with two medkits. And then Kara, you are doing just fine. We don't have you here, right? Alright, it's time to start with some endgame missions for us. Okay, so our marksmen are both hidden. That's already a great start. I really like this map. It's uh, probably gonna work in my favor. So, Kara, get in the car. And now we have a mobile car of uh, buffing. <laughs> Let's get in here. We spot nothing. But there seems to be something here. Should we just shoot? We move here and hope to spot something. Yes! Okay, so it has been spotted, but we cannot shoot at it yet. And we shoot at you from somewhere. No, and why not, is the question. So if I look in your direction, the wall, this tiny wall is getting in the way. I could just shoot at the wall, and uh, someone like you can probably break it. Already there. Like this is the wall. Or maybe we can't, and I just did absolutely nothing. On the move. Okay. So let's start hiding. Um, where can we hide you, though? That's a trickier question. Let's go here for now. I'm not feeling fully confident. There's two people there. I wish I had known. I wish I had known. Actually, it makes no difference. We cannot destroy the wall and these people at the same time. But here we go. Good missiles, my friends. If they hit. That's a miss. That's a small hit. Not the greatest pair of missiles. Okay, but we're gonna put an overwatch. Shoot at whomever dares to move in that direction. And then you. What are you gonna do? From here you'll be mega seen. Where do we go? Damn. Here? I'm gonna get wrecked. Right? No. Have faith. Anything that moves dies. Yeah. If you hit it. And if it does any difference that you shoot. Okay. Here we go. Pure round number one. Let's see what happens. <clears throat> Like, for now, I think all they saw was just a bunch of missiles coming in their way. So I don't know how they will react to this. Okay. Hi there. That was disgraceful. 
please stop. Okay, great. Perception heads, best item ever. I forgot that this mission was so full on spiders, but now I do remember. Okay, that sounded like a shield. Here comes one of the... This also sounded just like a shield. Infiltrator extends shield. Yeah, I really have to focus on the spiders. Okay, another nothingness. Let's see if we can missile both of them. That would be great. Pure heavy goes in the same direction. Okay. So can we somehow bombard this entire area? The sniper ends the turn the other way. You are just in the wrong way. Okay. That's a lot of movement for one turn. Ready to roll. So, question. What can you tell me about spider drones? They only have the torso, they're immune to everything, and they only have 60 hit points. So, can you actually just hit twice and kill them? Or maybe like three times? It's kinda unlikely that you hit so many times, right? Maybe I need to check if there are more spiders by going around the corner. Okay. Uh, I think this rocket could be very good. So let's go for it. I'm hoping to open the wall and to damage everyone, of course. Okay, we did not open the wall and we damaged someone. I hope. <laughs> That's as good as we could go. I cannot get there yet. That would be dangerous. Let's do this. Gotta keep going. Identifying target. Oh my god, we are not destroying the spider this way. Did we not give you bash? We did not give you bash. Okay, that was a great mistake. So how about I save you instead? That was a good save. Um, but I'm afraid now to go back, to just go back. So maybe we do a bit more exploration here. Advancing. I really wanted to see who or what is in here, but apparently we have no luck. So in that case, we're gonna go here I can do it. and hide in the corner. Not ideal by any means. Uh, but what we will absolutely do is move here, turn around, deposit, and out. We should be hitting three people. There we go. That could possibly save us a ton of damage in there. Um, but we haven't dealt with this pure infiltrator. Who only actually has a Synedrium crossbow. Okay. It's not really only. They can also do the spider. Oh, that's annoying. Yes. Can we shoot at them in any other fun way? Literally only from here. What if we go inside? Actually, I like that option a lot. Let's do that. Enemy spotted. That's a problem. Where is the spider? Quite far. That's less of a problem now. So we charge up. And now we can choose to fire. Add this heavy to maybe get the kill. Interesting. Or the wall. Oh yeah, I really like shooting at walls. Is this for real? Okay, that's way better. Okay, so we can try to hit the head, but we're likely going to hit the shield. And honestly, I think putting damage on this unit is way better. 
In both cases, we had to shoot at the head only. So it would have been okay no matter what. Hide again. What's the plan? Almost good to go. Um, I can pop in. Look at something to shoot at. Like the sniper in the open. I think it's in that direction, right? Or we can once again just try to hit the head. But that would mean very little. Okay, let's shoot in this general direction. We hit zero times. Very interesting. Okay, we hide back in the corner. And we move you a little bit further. You are also hidden, everyone has moved, thank you very much. Uh, the car can maybe look in this direction. End the turn. Okay, so far we killed only one spider. Mission complete. I mean of course we have hurt severely many others, but no kills are no kills. I guess I should have reconsidered about the, the shotgun, knowing that everyone would be so armored. But it's a little bit too late. <clears throat> I'm afraid that uh, spiders are going to show up from nowhere. After all, the perception check for the spiders is just quite ridiculous. Sniper gets a very good shot at us, and I hope they don't have just another. Good. Good, good, good. Let's see what else happens. A pure technician runs closer. Okay. Phew. That hurt. Honestly, you didn't need to do that. Okay. Breaks the wall and then gets nothing else done. Infiltrator goes. Activate. Will you move? Yes, they will move a little bit. Throws an EMP. No, a fire grenade. Thank you. You have done nothing to me. Okay, so a lot of things have happened, and I think it would be amazing if I could just jump up there. So what if I diagonal here and ask the jumping machine? Oh, that is just beautiful. So let's get up here, find out what is going on. Wow, there's no one here, so I would have been shooting at nothing. That's very interesting to know. Enemy contact. Enemy contact. Okay. So they want to come up this way, but there are no stairs. So I don't know if I should really worry about such a person. What could I do in the meantime? I could go here. I could shoot missiles. I could shoot missiles over here. That's also very good. And I really like this idea. Get rid of a spider and a spider generator. And uh, I kind of see the infiltrator a bit diagonal uh, with the shield position, so maybe we'll even get a good angle to aim at him. What? Okay, the second one hit. Can anyone tell me what the first missile hit? Because I. So I would love to hit you with a pistol shot. Can I? Okay. So there were two more spiders over here, three, and we didn't hit any with what our missile. There and that. Then we'll activate this. And I have two options. I could go for the pure technician. 
or I could go for the infiltrator up there. I think killing the pure technician makes more sense. Or shooting at the pure technician. And we're gonna go for torso. It actually even has less armor. And then we are gonna exert ourselves deeply. And then shoot a pistol shot. Which apparently we can no longer shoot in the direction of the... Of the infiltrator for whatever reason. Oh, can someone explain why this went like this? I'm certainly not going outside like that. Ooh, that sucks a lot. Can you take a general shot at this guy and kill it? You have to hit one time in an armor portion. One time, come on. Very good. Um, I need to shout again. That is for sure. Um, you are inside, you get out. And then you shout. Back inside. Move on with your life. Okay, sniper. Can we do sniper versus sniper? I mean, we also have this one, and we can actually look at him right now. So, let's give it a shot. Are we still hidden? Yes. Okay, we hit the shield, that's okay. The shield is gonna be immediately destroyed right now. You know what? I'm gonna go center on the shield. Okay. Shield destroyed. Let's do this. Not the best of shots, but here we go. Oh, I could also I could also give more actions to you, who then could take another shot, even though this is exerting ourselves severely. But maybe I can bring the priest closer. You have some more will points. Uh, have some more action points. Uh, very good. Head disabled. Also, or armor has been stripped. And if we're lucky, we're not lucky. And we exert ourselves again. Yes. Do it. We'll bring over the priest soon. Come on. That was scary. 50-50. Uh, Never lucky. Neverlucky.com And the problem is that you are extremely visible to this enemy. And that is something we did not want to do. You can also get down. I kind of like that idea a lot. Roll. Get down. We can jump out of here. <laughs> Maybe other people can't, but that one can. Alright. The moves have been moved. It's time to let it go. That's a spider. Oh, you're too far. Yes. Same with you. You're too far. Nope. Good. Did nothing. Okay, that's... Very good. Very happy about this. Two enemies killed with no action taken. There are still two spiders, at least. Wow! Did that hit the the top again? Oh shit! 
I'm actually quite lucky that it didn't get destroyed already. But maybe the infiltrator will take care of that. And that would be quite sad. You're heavy. Extends shield. Okay. Your infiltrator. Extends shield. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Eating up. What will you do? You're getting down, you're destroying the wall, and then you end the turn. Thank you. This one also ends the turn. This one also ends the turn. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so, question. If we were to shoot with the pistol, we would get you killed in 10 years. If we were to shoot with the sniper, we get you killed in one turn. Bye bye. No questions asked. I mean, that was the question, actually. I guess I did that. Then I think it's a good idea to finally try again to open up this area. It would get two things killed if we are somewhat lucky. Just a little bit lucky. Not even asking. Okay, good. Those were some good kills. Did not open everything up. But we will see what we can do. Okay, so... I'm thinking of getting here. Can we not walk anywhere? No. It has to be a jump. And uh, after this jump, we will see what we do. Because they panic. Oh. Taking aim. So if we shoot at everything on your arm or the torso, we kill it. I like that. Very good. So this one is also panicking. I see the panic right now, right? So it has to work. I should be able to stay here safe. Okay. Uh, that one is also panicking, so that means you are free to shoot at something. What is the sniper doing there? Very good. And you actually are at zero with points. So what can you actually attack with? Uh, machine gun, okay. Alternatively, I could heal the uh, will points, but I think it's just better to come over here and start shooting at people. Maybe you begin? This gives me explosive range as well, right? So I could go here. What is the current range? Loud and clear. This gives 50% range. EMP sounds like a grenade that uh, not Cynedrion would develop, but the others. But it, I think it is Cynedrion. Okay, we're gonna go here. So what I'm thinking is, what if I bombard this person with three grenades? And I would like to try that out. It is a good theory. So we're gonna do some swapsies over here. Like this. We're gonna I'll begin with a shredding grenade. Oh, look at this range. Beautiful. So, shred, shred, shred. <laughs> Our grenadier class finally working out. What do you do? EMP 60. We actually have no Here idea what nothing. this will do. So, I think it's a great opportunity to test it out. Here we go. Absolutely nothing. Okay, the legs are disabled because the the EMP hit only the legs. That means whatever. Did we damage the shield? Well, we have to check differently. 
The shield has been zero damage. Okay. I'm gonna need a grenade and then this and then this one more work. grenade. I want to throw it in front of them so that the shield at least gets damaged or right on top of them. I think right on top is a great idea. Let's see how this works. Enemy miss. still active. Yeah. Did not consider we could miss by so long. Okay, but if we hit the head, we're gonna do some good damage. Right, we hit the shield instead. Okay, and car. Uh, the car still has a full priest inside. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hide behind the tree. And we are just gonna pass the turn. I'm hoping that the priest has everyone within range. No, but if I move here. Oh my god, there's still a spider. Okay, that's too far. So priest once again. There we go. Okay, that sounds good. I am quite ready to pass. Just checking out. This is just so, beep boop, beep boop. The only one that can still move are the spider and the heavy. And whomever we have not yet seen. Okay, so those were the panics. Now comes heavy. Decent amount of damage. I'm not gonna say it was the worst. And just protects themselves. But the AoE is already starting to make its work. What was that? We are now ready to begin again. So the shield is very hurt. We can leverage that. Um, but first, before we do that, your arm has no armor. I was in sight. So is it this arm? No, it's of course the other arm. So I'm thinking we move here. And kill you. Very good. Death by arm amputation. Uh, look at that. We have a repair kit. Hmm. Thinking no action point. Right? I'm thinking I'm gonna shoot a repair up the, uh, up the door, up the car. This maybe next turn. You come in, and I kind of have to kill this spider, hopefully, spider disappear. Hmm. I would be okay just shooting at this shield until I get it. And I get it with two shots. Let's see, I go down only to 42 and I still don't deal any damage to it. So, no, that's not gonna work out. This will... Um, excuse me? The shield should be destroyed. One HP for whatever reason. Whatever game. Whatever. Okay, car. What are we gonna do? Maybe I should have just hammered this person. You know, maybe it's Kara's time to just show up and do Kara's things. I'm a little bit afraid. You know what? We're gonna hide for one more time. It's also a good idea because it's gonna give everyone more uh, will points, more cast material, and you you should not even show up anymore. Actually, is there any chance that the sniper hits us here? I don't think so, right? It will be very, very bizarre. Oh shit! Is there any reason not to fire? No, there is not. Let's go. Okay. This place stinks. Yes, I know. Okay. 
Come on, we did not even break it. Okay. And you, inside, should be still fine. End the turn. Shift the turn. Five will points recovered. Okay, there is someone else inside. Good. Good to know. If you're a sniper, please move forward. I'm gonna overwatch. Oh my god, takes the most bizarre cross shot ever in existence. Luckily, misses. Here goes panic. Mm, mm, mm. That's a new person, what am I saying? Okay. So, we look at the shield, we deal 40 damage, right? So, if we hit a little bit, this should go down. We'll see what we do with the other turn. Uh, I should be able to activate only once, therefore is there really a point in doing that? This infiltrator can get demolished by me. Did not consider that. This heavy can also be just outright killed by me. And even better at the legs. But if we miss the legs we're gonna be very sad. And if we hit the machine gun we're gonna be ultra sad. this and that's a kill. Very good. Let's move here. Hmm. Ah, I can actually check. So I would only move, be able to move a little bit away. I think I want to use my will points for that. Okay, we will use 30, 45. So if we do hit the headshot, we'll see how much damage we deal. We deal a kill. Very good. I'm going. I'll make room for you. You have earned it. And then the sniper saw us in the craziest crossover. And then there's also someone else coming in that direction. So I said I wanted to repair the car. This seems like a great opportunity to do so. So we move there. I was bored. We go here, but we don't enter the vehicle yet. It is only for augmented body parts, not for cars. That makes me super sad, actually. Let's blast them! Okay, just get in. And let's drive away from here. <clears throat> okay. I think I'm gonna stop here because everyone else could recover from uh, will points. The sniper was panicking, so we, we basically got an extra turn. And whoever is moving in this direction got even closer. Let's ask the car. Hey, car. Hey, Carl. Who's there, Carl? <laughs> no one is there. Okay. Let's ask this sniper who is there. Apparently no one, because looking in diagonal is a crazy experience that we will never do. Okay, so we're gonna spend this person's turn noticing that we cannot find that person. So it's you know what? Probably it's a it's a pure um, infiltrator. Otherwise I don't understand why we cannot see them. And regarding Liu, we will go for the head. How many shots do we have? Five more. Go for the head. We went for the shield. And I want to break line of sight 100%, so that's gonna be good. We can get you out of here. And back into the cover. And then we're gonna pass the turn. Let's see. 
Okay. I don't know where that explosion happened. I'm starting to get a little bit scared. Oh my god. This person blowing themselves up. Oh, they were spiders without a master. I think something like that. It's very interesting, actually. Okay, this one extends the shield. I wonder if the sniper is doing an overwatch. No, it seems like they came way closer. Okay, enemy spotted. So they're in that awkward place. Look at this, our will points are back to full. Oh my god, a priest is the best thing ever. So I would need to go here to start shooting at them. I like the idea of baiting them further. This pure heavy is just a machine gunner, okay. Yep. Thank you all for participating in our experiments. Please. Keep your arms inside the car at all times. Am I gonna take this shot? It's a free shot, right? Am I even gonna take two shots? I'm down to three ammo. Question, do we have reloading? Yes, we do. Of course we deal so much damage because attacks from undiscovered means uh, means that we deal 50% extra damage, while we have not been spotted. Ah, that could have been a good kill. No, but it could have been. Yes. Yes, it could have been. Okay, we're gonna shoot from here. Good luck. Hit the shield. How do we feel about this? Not good. On the move. That's what we needed. One hit. And go. Okay. Um, then we're gonna set up an overwatch like this, just in case it does something. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> I would also get scared. <laughs> Alright, and then our MVP mana battery and come here and do their one appearance permission I gotta say actually that was an amazing performance of the mana battery because dear lord having infinite will points that's very good okay so the car got damaged but I think that's quite okay I mean, if that's the only price we have to pay to get uh, the pure out of the out of the rain, do we even get something out of this? We'll see. So we actually had three pure missions total: the intro, uh, the one time they attacked a haven, and this one. Whole expansion dedicated to this. We never reached that area of the map, but whatever. Subject 24 is no more. What remained of the Pure's uh, stronghold has been completely destroyed and its technology stripped. Teams managed to retrieve a large amount of archived drives containing terabytes of data. Fortunately, the advanced encryption proved impossible to crack. What secret Subject 24 had, he has taken them to the grave with him. He can only rest knowing that the threat of the pure is no more. 100 skill points have been obtained. And uh, we put everything. 
not sure I'm gonna need a lot more of uh, um, EMP grenades. I mean, I could actually use them against the other things, the guardians. Okay, so I want to head back home, right? Wait, no, we are we are also protecting a haven very soon. Wow, I already forgot about that. Um, yes, yeah, so you want to go here. But then you two want to get to this place, and uh, I will just change everyone before we start the mission. So don't start the mission. Southwest Africa base will be attacked. Okay. I think we can still make it in time. If we jump over with the people from this place. Okay. Personnel! Let's see. Um, so bike one is fully geared. You are fully geared. Who are you actually? Viral. So we're gonna write viral here just to understand. Viral. So whatever makes him feel more viral is our goal. Good. Got it. Right now this is uh, quite a good idea. And then we went out too fast. Uh, Mili, do you need any support? Yes, you have lost a chest. But wait, you actually want an augmentation here. You want this augmentation, which costs a ridiculous amount. But we're about to defend the Haven, so we should really think about it. Okay. So, Valentina, you will be the first one that gets to attack twice ever. Uh, did we mutate your legs? Is that what we did? I think we did, right? Yeah, the stealth legs that can do an electric kick is so bad. Okay, okay, okay. So we got that, we got this. Why are you using the minigun? When would you be able to? When you have adrenaline rush. Uh, okay. Okay, okay. All right, so for now we said uh, Kiwi needs a full set of everything. Todd, you can get this armor, that's very good. You can get more ammunition of this, that's actually very good. And then we get you out. And Jonathan, you are the person with the heavy gun usage that we have not figured out what to do yet. Okay. For now, we shall go like this. Uh, you need armor. Okay. So let's start with that. I am missing the super gear. Where is it? Two pieces. And one piece. Wait, but that's already someone. Okay. So you are the only one who can wear this. I'm pretty sure I can rescue a helmet from someone else. Okay. Um, okay, so you can use this, and I'm pretty sure we can get you a weapon. So what weapons can you use right now? Crossbow and spider drone. Well, <laughs> wait, we have a spider drone. Of course. Of course, we, we can do all of this. And let's get you one of these. As a backup. And we'll just keep throwing spiders. I think that's what we'll do. Uh, do we want the new razor? I mean, why not? Okay, so you are done. You are done. You are done. Then we have the bike here. Good. Then we have the heavy who is done, and then we need uh, armor and legs for Jonathan rifle. Legs. Armor. Wait, this is already a person from the spot itself. So... 
Jonathan Rifle, you have a conditioned head. I think it would be great to mutate your chest as well. With the regeneration effect. And we just hope that your legs will remain clean. Okay. Um, so that is a problem solved. And finally, the priest. The priest who just begun its career. We have even, not even looked at what this priest can do. But Citizen Eileen is not the person. Kara. Kara has the rest of your gear, Mr. Priest. Gear, gear, ammo. That's it. Uh, we could also think of more mutations. Let's see. Right now, we can only do the shout, which is very decent, uh, because it's gonna give everyone movement points. So what else can we do for you? We uh, First we check this. What do you do? Accuracy 5, Accuracy 5. That's actually quite cute. Perception 4, Perception 7. So I would say replacing the legs makes more sense. And my leg options right now are... Stomp, which really makes no sense. But gives so 12 Accuracy? <laughs> what? Okay, I didn't see that coming at all. And this one gives 30 stealth. I think a currency is better. Uh, it does remove a little bit of speed, but that's fine. Yeah, I like it. Look at that. Look at that chunk. <laughs> this is so silly. Okay. Uh, I have everything I could want. You have a viral, right? Uh, okay, so we actually have two sources of viral. Holy shit. This could be really good. It's time to deploy. And that's that's the one thing we learned. Okay, so yesterday at the end of a stream, someone was kind enough to let me know that you could actually pull together two ships in order to deploy for a mission. Mm. We even have one person too many. Um, who is too many in this one? It's, uh, Either rifle or viral. Thank you. I think this is the way I want to answer. So I want Kiwi to exist. Uh, they need levels. And I need someone as reliable as Valentina to deliver melee punches. Valentina is hurt. Do I really want to risk that? I mean, the bike can fix that turn one. Hmm. The fact that the bike can fix it makes it really easy. Okay, we are not sure what we are facing, actually. No, it's actually a normal mission. Okay, in that case, you know what, Valentina, I think you will be waiting outside. Correct. Will I miss having Valentina? I mean, the, I'm gonna triple check, portable check. This looks very default and the fact that the attacking strength is 10 and that we're only gaining plus 8 i think it will be like a, a hard mission but not a Silla mission and for that because we are defending disciples of anu i feel quite inspired so let's let's go wow i think for once no one will be riding the bike at least no one needs to ride the bike oh very very interesting Oh. Always stretch, sit up straight. In here we usually say uh, posture check, in case you're not sitting correctly upright. All right. We start by seeing no enemy. That's Already quite a surprise. Also, no friendly. That's uh, a surprise. The bike shall go exploring. Enemy spotted. Good. That's a normal enemy. I'm happy. That is a civilian. And you know what's amazing of civilians? I can make them run like crazy. 
so I will use them to spot more enemies. <laughs> While, of course, going towards the escape point. Okay, so we did spot something already, which is a friendly unit. Which we don't get if we do that. This civilian will escape in the other direction. Let's move over here. They're basically spies now. Okay, so we have a Triton Poacher. That means they have a Paralyzed Pistol and Paralyzed Arm. That's very nice. We throw a tiny spider. Like this. Hmm. And then we throw Check a tiny spider. Out. Where? Over here. here. Then you can shoot from here. Okay, you can see the end of an arm. Let's show from this what position. we can do. Let's Watch see. this. Um, you know what? We're gonna do a test run. And what I mean by that, I'm gonna punk over here. Punk. Okay. That poor person got demolished. <laughs> that was that was really good, Todd. Good, good job. And then we are gonna instill Frenzy, which I forgot to do before we started. And now we can see that we can barely run anyway. Okay. We're gonna hide over here. Um, but you... <laughs> you can run a screen. Or two. Jonathan Rifle. So let's put you in a nice position over here. We're so deeply mutated at this point. <laughs> and then I'm missing you. Viral. Oh my god. Look at how much they can move. If I dash, I can reach this person turn one. I like it. Gotta keep on pushing. Starting with that just changes everything. Okay. Go grab literally you. And then you. We're just gonna. <laughs> We're just gonna run in here. Target located. Oh, okay. No, that's fine. We're gonna run in here Moving because. In. Um, it's just gonna distract them at the very least or just make them wonder what's going on since my movement has been so insanely ridiculous this uh, this round bike is gonna hide over here we're still not having direct line of sight of this so they would have to move if they want to shoot and if they shoot uh, if they move they cannot shoot twice and we are ready to end it okay Moves, moves, and... Ow! Pretty bad here. Come on. What a start. <laughs> what a ridiculous start, come on. That was, that was a little bit annoying. I hope I have a... Oh no. Enemy spotted, good. Turn end it. And this Python footpath moves around and disabled arm. If we're lucky, we still have a no. We're just we're just disabled. And that's the person we bombarded, I believe. Okay, I'm quite okay with this as a turn one. Uh, wait. I am quite okay with this as a turn one. <laughs> it could have gotten a little bit more scarier, but luckily for us it's not. Okay. 
So my options are to explode here or to move here and explode much more on this other person or to move here and hit no one. Yeah, that's not good. This I want this one I like way more. Oh. Very nice. Oh, who else did we hurt? No one. Good. So disabled head. Let's try this. This would not be good enough. Uh, you have a med kit. So you're gonna start by using it. And you technically can bash, so let's get Here back. Here comes the phoenix. Yeah. Great fun. Um, a bash for 90? Is that, that bad? did not like and you can you get some more damage done here uh, stomping costs two okay still frenzy one we also have Jonathan rifle I also bash from here. Okay, so we're gonna take this shot. Hoping for good hits. Nice. Ten is still not the amount that this person has as defense. Then I could go for this. It's gonna deal 90 to someone who has less than 90 health. It's not gonna kill probably because of armor. But it's gonna daze, which is already really good. And also they're gonna bleed out on the next one. Good. Then I feel like I could kill this thing by dashing with my ridiculous dash distance. And then I'm already having a good aim. And it's not good enough yet. There's no reason not to dash towards. I know that there's still another enemy to the left. But uh, if we ensure this kill, then the dangers go down. Next up, this civilian has earned its right to run. Yes. This civilian has earned its right to smoke. Smoking. Okay. Oh, look at that. Hello, Mr. Priest. Please save me. Uh, this spider is gonna move in this direction. And then you can probably get here to kill this, especially if we dash. Oh, keep going. And you can probably get in range of this and also stall them, um, paralyze them. if we trigger the overwatch before we destroy all the walls or if we don't trigger it at all i guess that's also an option and paralysis that was pretty decent even though we didn't have enough to paralyze all the way and um, they won't be able to attack that's more of a problem you my friend still able to attack but why if you don't have a uh, because you're a berserker of high level who can also ignore uh, parts broken. Very good. Bonk. Bonk. The daze is exactly what we want. And the last person who can move is you. And you can from here apply a little bit of fire. Not enough will points anymore. Oh, that's a shame. It's hard to shoot like this. Yeah, it is hard to shoot. So, where could you have a better shot? 
Go here. Oh, that's pretty good. Two hits? Wow. That's that's pretty bad. Looks dangerous. No, actually looks quite good. Okay. Wow, the two virus was uh, quite lame. Okay, situation is gradually under control. And this guy has not done anything at all. Good job. Very soft. And this other guy is like, what? A moment of revelation. That was pretty good. Okay, so this guy moves one pace and puts the shield up again. The Triton Hitman shoots double, triple, and then still gets to move. Very good. This one is still skulking around. We'll try to discover them next time. I'm very impressed that they managed to somehow get there. I'm guessing that means panic on someone. Ah, no! Frenzy is immune to panic. Excuse me? First of all, since when? And second, what the fuck? And then they get to hide? Oh my god. Myrmidons are the fucking... Okay, Myrmidon. Please tell me about you. You are an acid Myrmidon. You are gonna explode when we finish you off. That means I should probably get away. Like step one, get away. Step two. Let's see now. The two is probably bombard. And hopefully break walls. That would be ideal. But hit the Myrmidon, please. We need to remove all armor. Of course, I did not consider the worst possible scenario, where I actually only hit my own unit, don't break anything. That was quite garbage. That was like absolute 100% garbage. Okay, and then finally, these people are no longer frenzied, so I think I don't have enough will points to do frenzy again. Okay. I think I will just have to rest. Uh, this civilian just runs. And you, my friend, cannot even do anything. Okay. But I could get you here. And just take a, sh a shot. Actually, my best use of this character is to move forward and be bait. Honestly. As absolutely mean as that sounds. Executing. Then we throw another spider over here. And Moving. then we hide. And you also, you ran away. <laughs> Yeah. That was mega bullshit. Okay. Now for a few questions. Uh, standing by. Can we throw a grenade this over might here? work. Um, actually, we're looking for the most to damage the guy upstairs and drop him down to ground level. That would be the best. Still that seems like it works. So, how about we get in here? Who are we more worried about? Scourge Alpha? I wanna say yes. I 
this person has been severely hurt. Ah, but they can still do a lot. So yeah, actually, we're gonna penalize you. Even though you're dead in two turns. And maybe even... Okay, yeah, still two turns. Uh, and then I'm gonna go back. And break line of sight. And then if the gunman wants to shoot at me, then they can do that. But it, will, it will be tricky. I can do break this. Line of sight as well. Okay, anyone else who has not moved? Yes, Spidertron. Okay, we get the Spidertron closer to all these marks. And end the turn. Aw, I got frenzied by the priest. Ah, I think that's the... yeah. That is the other guy. Uh, who I heard at the beginning of the of the match. So right now my biggest problem is this and and the um, the Myrmidon, of course. We'll see how we go. Okay. At least the bait worked out perfectly. Yep. I think we still live. <laughs> Ridiculous. Alright, so can we instill frenzy again? Because I can see us panicking. Okay, actually we're not panicking. Guess it's my turn. In that case. For the disciples of Anu! I guess for Anu that would make more sense. Ooh. We even get to steal the experience from the kill. You did a great job, my friend. Bye bye. Did you drop something for us? Ah, thank you! That's so kind of you. Okay, Spidertron, come over here. And we find the body of the person. Okay. And then finally. What's the plan? person is panicking. It's okay, so we can count on this one being dead. So the question is, do we explode this spider? Uh, ready. <sighs> you know what? We are gonna blow this person up. Actually, that's a lie. We're just gonna paralyze them. Enemy spotted, but this enemy is very dead. Right. 30, takes 50, this is dead. And you... Paralysis. I'm very inclined on passing the turn in that case. Because... We only need to paralyze that last person, and then that's it. Approaches us. They are very nice. We saved all the civilians. And we even captured two more mutagen people. <laughs> Barely got any experience for this. But you know what we got? Rewards. Many rewards.
Okay, you have defeated all hostile forces. The leader is grateful, but 353. If we were super low. Uh, and we did all of this, and Kara never got to punch anyone with her double move. And then two art from captures. And uh, we have failed to find a location. Are we making grenades for real? How about we make some more? Okay. Alright, so how does this continue? We check that there are no flyers. Okay. Then we check the base that's gonna be under attack. It's this one, base in. Southwest Asia base. Wait, no, 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 this is not the one. Southwest Africa base. Okay, so actually we... Oh, look, an antediluvian. Okay. We can only make it with the people that we just rescued. And the question is, do you have any type of healing or repair? Mm, repair and heal. But I don't think anyone got hurt. Okay, someone did get hurt. Oh, Valentina was hurt to begin with. Okay, that's fine. So we start moving here, and then we move the Helios as well. And then we ask the Tiamat what's going on. Right, we were here just to replace the car, basically. Car 2, Central Asia base. Car 1, David. David the car. Alright, options. Once again into the maze, Bioengineering Site 2. The Scorpion. Corruption of the mind, which we have never seen. I feel like with this super A team that we have, corruption of the mind does make sense. Okay, Behemoth is doing Behemoth things, which we cannot stop. Okay. One team is there, second team is there. Research. Venom crossbow development. Yes. That's what we wanted to see before we started making some of them. Okay. Let's go in here. Make more harvests. Actually, you know what? Until we're down, we probably should consider making food out of them. Question, where is the Tiamat? Okay, the Tiamat has still quite a journey. The disciples of Kanu Haven is under attack. Well, that's problematic. Which one? Ooh, can we get there in time and back? Attacking force 27, this is a Scylla Haven. I am very sorry, but I don't think I can help you. This is a lair. We're getting dangerously low to the surviving humans, right? That is a problem. Okay, the problem is I cannot really... Oh, wait, yes. Question. North America, what happened to you? All facilities got... Uh, hurt. Do we really care this much about this place? But the problem is, what am I gonna go do against Scylla? Right, because we assume there is a Scylla here. If I go here, I cannot defend the base. And I could fail both, so really what's the point? Okay, we will go with the latest thought, which is, what is the point? I'm very sorry. Okay, we have built sniper armors, which will start sharing.
and some modules. And the models could be used right now. You, for example. Oh, no? For real? Okay. I guess on you. But we don't want that. Um, the same for you. I guess this is good. And the same for... Uh, you know what? We are gonna double check. Oh! So only on on uh, mutated we cannot do this. In this case I do prefer that. I also would not mind keeping it. <laughs> no more grenades here, okay. And you actually did quite fine, so... You can continue as it is. Okay, this is gonna be a tricky base defense. But we will see what happens. Do we have a heavy with shout? Yes. Okay, we have at least one shout. Do we buy more willpower from you? I think we kinda should. Mm. <clears throat> Let's go. Okay. Hard base defense. Second. So, two sidons just to begin with. Okay. Well, at least I'm lucky that uh, this person is kind of hidden. Okay. So, how does this work? Okay. We can have you around the corner. Okay, we can run away back to you. Jonathan rifle. Okay, run back. Then we move you back. Minefragger number two. Okay. Where is the bike? And where is the priest? Uh, the priest is gonna activate Frenzy next turn, not this one. Valentina Mili. Oh, look at how slender they are. It's so cute. Oh, and boy. where is the bike? And the bike picks someone up? Ready. No, not really. So we're gonna hide you around here. Let's do this. And the bike. Do we pick up Valentina? I feel like no. Maybe at this point it's better if Frenzy is used on its own. Okay, we are ready for turn one. Got an instigator, very good. That already sounds like a great grenade. That also sounds like a great grenade. More great grenades. 
Ah, hello, Siren number two. I'm so happy that you're both here. These people have a lot of movement. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. Very good. I mean, I'm, I'm actually quite happy about this. Usually there's like this uh, weird before space, like where the camera is right now, where you're not sure you can do everything. Okay, so if we instill frenzy, do we hit everyone? Yes. Very good. Let's begin with that. Second, an amazing trick. If we break this, suddenly we are in line of sight. So I wanna go here. This is gonna be very tricky. Yes. It's Breaks. Come on, let me, let me, let me. Oh no! It's costing me movement every time. Okay, there we go. And now we can ask you to shoot this way. And we're gonna hit the bike if we do that. I don't like that idea anymore. So, do we want to paralyze the siren? No, I feel like I should move back. And we should just destroy these sirens, which I really like. Wait. So, I'm gonna paralyze you. Very good. And I'm even gonna move further away. Still being good aim. So, move number one. Please, don't hit my soldiers. And with the last one, we're probably gonna use Warcry. Very good. That's a lot of armor removed. And Warcry hits four people. Very good. Uh, five people, if we count this one. Now, together with Frenzy, that means I can punch this thing twice. And still move back. How good is that? Well, that is one option. Another option is going here, activating adrenaline rush, and then um, and then shooting the minigun three times. I could do that from here. My turn. Question: Is your armor still there? Yes. So four, four, four. Who else do we have? Uh, you are vital, so maybe maybe you need to check out what you can actually hit and still remain effective. Like maybe I shoot all of this at you. Question: Thirty-two will points. Thirty-two will points. Yeah, that makes no difference. Okay. So we could get up to here, or here rather, shoot, and um, go around the corner, uh, dash around the corner, dash away. Uh -huh, uh -huh. This one is the most interesting, maybe we even get the kill, that's fine, cute, 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 what is around the corner? An Arthron Myrmidon champion, but he was shouted at, so that's effective. I mean, this person was shouted at too, um, but now it's just one less person. And now we can dash away to safety. Gotta keep on pushing. And more than safety, it's also getting out of the way of other people. That's that's important. Um, I can shoot at the head and miss three times. Clean, very clean. 
you can also shoot. No, that's not good. Shooting. So actually, I completely overestimated things. Let's destroy heads. That is the name of the game. So I'm gonna move here. Who do we still have? Actually, let's ask that way. Uh, we have you. Let's we show have what we can the do. instigator. And we have the melee smasher. So actually, it's gonna go melee first. Or ah, we could do melee last. Okay, you know what? We're gonna do that. Uh, because melee last is gonna then stay here to use her attacks. Uh, we go full head here. Very good. And then we have you. You're gonna wait. Coming up. So we are gonna go here. We are gonna activate adrenaline rush. And then we are gonna shoot a minigun at your face. Is this correct? A minigun at your torso. A minigun at your tail. That's very cool. Then we're gonna go for a minigun at your tail. And a minigun at your tail. Very effective. Well done, my friend. Mm. Additionally, we are gonna place a spider here. And a mimic beacon here. And we're gonna hope for the best. Oh, we could place a final mimic beacon here. I kinda like that idea a lot. Like for one turn, it means almost full immunity. That is sexy. That also means I use literally everything that that person would have. That's okay. okay Triton footpath moves forward. Find Fragger 1. Yes, they cannot get through. That's what we wanted. Shield bear goes for... Okay, so it's not Mimic Beacon. Keep that very much in mind. Because that's how you lose. Did we lose Kara? No, that was not Kara. Okay. That would have been very sad, but that was not Kara. That was very sad anyway. Okay, Spider, I think we're gonna go here and explode. I basically get one and a half person. But I'm so salty. Very good. And we are gonna shoot this. That's so sad. Just like that? Dead? Just like that. Target hit. Okay, that's a lot of armor. Very good. Uh, ready. Um, can we shoot here and do something useful? No. But if I get here... I can do this. Probably. It's gonna be... Uh, what did we destroy in armor? Barely anything. So, shall we get the leg? Shall we get the arm? Ah, oh, the arm still is kind of weak. Very good. Also, that's 10 virus. Is that even enough? Nope. I'm on the move. Take it easy. Priest. And you see the carapace? Yes. So, let's do more viral damage. 20 virus is enough, right? Yes, 20 virus is enough. What are we doing? Finally. Are we already out of people? Okay. 
finally we move you here. And then we destroy this pincer or this face. Pincer. The pincer is way more dangerous. Mm -hmm. And then we get back. Oh, I'm super salty. Do we have a plan? Well, you tell me. Hmm. I could paralyze this person. I could also take a break. With more spiders. I hope this helps. Spider there. Repositioning. I hope this works. Move back. That was so sad. Yeah. I think I'm just gonna stay here and just shout again. So if I stomp right now, I'm gonna hit everyone, right? I'm not even gonna try. Wow, that was super unnecessary death. I really thought we had a solid plan, but... I think I missed that diagonal melee attack through all the Mimic Beacons. Basically, that's what it was. Okay, spit poison, gets nothing. Will they spit poison again? No, they just... Ah, they cannot spit poison. Then the group prime gets not into melee range. Ultra annoying. Okay, so... The spider cannot get through because the bike is in the way. And now the spider can get through. I think this is a great place. Is this dead? Yes. Is this dead? Yes. Okay. So two dead and you... This is in the way, but... Is it? Probably. Unga. <laughs> Italy. Yeah, you switch. The cats are still alive. Yeah. Once again, getting the arm. Very good shots. Uh, I'm gonna rest with this person because I want to instill frenzy next turn. Ready ish. Ready ish. Then we are gonna be here. I can do this. I feel actually quite good about shooting this way. There you go. Here. And do we want to use the final Let's spider? Try this. I guess we can put it here just like last time. Let's see now. Uh I think I want to rest. No, I cannot rest. I have to shout. One last time, I think. And we are going to rest with you. And then we're gonna come here. Get a good paralysis going again. Um, Ooh. 
we're para flinching basically. They have paralysis and they have fear. So whenever one runs out, the other will kick in. So this is dead, this is dead, and you are shouted upon. It seems like things are wrapping up. But really, that's death. Python moves forward. Myrmidon champion moves forward. And uh, we're ready to go again. Instill frenzy. <coughs> I think I actually want to get this guy out of the way. So let's do this. Let's do this. One punch would be enough. It is not. But can we force you into the car? Into the bike rather. Get out of the way. And get out of the way. I want to shoot this down and actually try to capture the mind fragger, even though we won't be able to. Hmm, sad. That means I should capture this. And kill the mind tracker. Oh yeah, there's still that person. And okay, so you you have almost nothing else. So I could blow you up with a shotgun. And the shotgun Actually, I can't, because I cannot move through the bike. Oh, that's horrible. Even with frenzy, it's not enough. Um, I could go here, jump. We're gonna try out. So come here, jump, gets me behind the bike. And then we have to pray that it's a good shot? I mean, we do have virus. Okay. Actually, it should be fine. Even kill. Good. And finally, that person in the back. I could dash here. So the question is, are you doing anything? Oh, I could get here and paralyze, or attempt to paralyze. I like that idea the most, actually. Uh, mainly because if it doesn't work, I can pass it on to someone else. I mean, it, it will work, I just don't know how much paralysis this needs. Okay, eight seems like that's not enough, right? So I come here, I grab your um, your item, and then we die. Not loving this idea. Let's hope everything goes fine. So I grab your new razor. You can take this, and then new razor paralysis mind trigger. And we shift the turn. We're coming in here. What will the last one do? Is that a shot? Yes. Takes a shot at the car. That's okay. At the very least, so yes, we lost that very important unit. But at the very least, we are able to 
capture so many specimens of them. That means we can get the food, that means we can probably buy a new unit. And honestly, Kara... No, sorry. Um, that melee person... The worst part about losing that melee person is just that they have the, the good outfit. Because Kara has way better experience and uh, abilities to be a melee person. What is, keeps falling? Oh, my poster. <laughs> okay. I think the saddest part about all of this... Uh, I hope I actually recovered everything. Is that uh, we now don't have like two full teams? Actually, you know what we do. I forgot that this is how it works. Okay, I could still go here and try. I don't have any hopes. Like, literally zero hopes. <laughs> I wonder if. Uh, is a Scylla capturable. <laughs> Capture a Pandoran with virus ability. I did not know that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. So the gift and Tiamat move that way. And who will reach first? Oh, they keep on evolving. Please, jeez, stop. So what can you do? You're just the best shooter, right? That's what you are. You are just a poison shooter. Fine. What are you? Acid worms. Okay. Acid worms is fine. Okay. So, you have arrived, it's really the nick of time. I don't think I can wait for anyone else. If I hit deploy, you seem like a normal mission. Oh, that's crazy. Okay, okay, okay. So who do we have? We don't have a vehicle, that's already horrible. That is like ultra bad. Bad enough that makes me not want to try this. It's just three units against whatever amount of enemies. Why did I not check this? keep getting higher and higher and plus 10 I kind of predict an entire Scylla okay we are not gonna go unless this other ship also makes it which we know it's not gonna happen so research complete okay damage on mine fraggers cute Haven destroyed okay 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 cancel cancel so the Haven got destroyed just as we suspected, not much we could do. Um, we are gonna go here. And here. Uh, because while we were away, they just took the opportunity to take over everything. And then finally, personnel. Yeah, man. So, Citizen Eileen, you are fully geared. Excellent. We're only missing the shoulder cannon whenever one day we are able to do it. Um, Pascal shotgun is missing. Helmet. Um, pistolier is fully geared. Wait. Danger. And now it's correct. Uh, and we also said that Pistolier was going to use a 
Paralysis Neural Pistol. Don't have many shots, right? Yeah. Then. Uh, you need pants, Thomas. Grenadier. Uh, you need grenades as well. Okay, we went overboard. And Kara, you need everything. Oh no. We lost the chest piece. Wait, did we? We cannot have lost the chest piece. It's just ah no, of course we have a we have a literal priest. <laughs> okay, and um, but we did want to augment you, Kara, with the melee weapon thing. So let's actually do that. Now we're ridiculously low on everything, but we have to do it. Oof, okay, so the car doesn't need anything. I think we're done. I think I want Viral in Team A. Like the, the shotgunner who had the Viral ability. Uh, you can actually not buy anything that I want by now. Okay. However, I would love to continue this after I take a break. So thank you all very much for joining this far and I will see you soon.